going down the line and taking off bandages and being able to uh, experience that moment in someone's life when they can see again. Oh, it looks wonderful. <laughs> 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 and if it doesn't make a difference, I would still do it. Um, but the thing that's kind of been interesting about this work is I actually see it making a difference. Tonight we meet people from our close-in communities who are taking on the challenges of the community that wraps around the whole globe. They've chosen to be part of something much, much bigger than themselves. We're a nonprofit organization with an audacious goal, which is to treat curable blindness in the developing world. And there are so many of us waiting and hoping. And then it's time for the bandages to come off. At first, I'm not sure. The daylight is so strong. Good, little edema. Not too bad. And then. Good. Yes. You see? Yeah. Yeah. When there's 20 million people in the world that uh, could benefit from uh, cataract surgery. And thank you, thank you. I'm so happy. You've given me back my life. I want to be a part of helping to find them all. Human rights organizations requested accompaniment because they were being targeted uh, with intimidation, with threats, um, and some were murdered. So are you afraid sometimes? Together, uh, I'm not afraid. If someone needs help and I can help them, it's kind of like my business to help them. I'm not just going to sit around and just watch someone else suffer when I can do something about it. And when I saw people eating food out the garbage was when I decided that, well, I think we can do a little bit better than this. You can't think of the 20 million blind people. All you can think of is the person and or the eye in front of you. <laughs> and there's uh, many ways all of us could make big differences in uh, individuals' lives, and that's where we should start. If someone says, you know, you re I really admire this, and I can see how you found some meaning in your life, I'd really love to do something like that, but I can't because of X, Y, Z, and this entanglement and this obligation, what would you say to them? Well, I think you can always find a reason not to do something, can't you? <laughs> to watch this full episode, click the link in the description below. To watch other Immense Possibilities trailers, click the box on the left. And to help more Immense Possibilities happen, click the box on the right. Do what you can do. Thanks.